So I had um, put a poll on my community wall, and I appreciate uh, everyone who participated in the poll. Now, um, here's the um, here's the poll that I placed on my community wall. All right. Now I ask y'all a question. Uh, now I ask y'all the question: uh, Is love is a feeling or is it a choice? Once again, is love a feeling or is it a choice? Now, uh, 67% of y'all believe that love is a feeling, while 33% of y'all believe that love is a um, choice. All right. So here's here's my perspective on this. Okay. I, I believe that uh, love is, an, in fact, a choice. Once again, I believe that love is, in fact, a choice. Now, do our uh, feelings become involved when you make that choice? Absolutely, does because that is part of the human emotion for us to have feelings. But, however, feeling is not feelings is not the overall decision making based on love. It is based on a choice. Let me let me give you give y'all example. Um, well, whenever um whenever you become a parent, right, and you become a parent to your children's right. Do you feel like loving your children or do you choose to love them because you know that it's the right thing to do? You know, uh, knowing it's the right thing to do, you know that the choice will be beneficial for both you and your children. So I guarantee that uh, each and every last one of y'all choose to love your children. It may be times where your children, you may feel like, at times that your children might do things to disappoint you. They may um, do things to even get on your nerves and different things like that. But the but the uh, end goal is the same, which you choose to love your children. This is the reason why uh, when we even talk about single mothers, or it can be mothers in a two-parent household, whatever case may be right. But this is the reason why... Um, Mothers will protect their children, even when they know their children has done wrong. Because they choose to do it. It's not a feeling, but it's something they choose to do. I'll give y'all another example. And now we're talking about relationships dealing with love, all right? Another another example is this. Uh, when, when, uh, when you initially meet a person for the first time, do you choose to interact with that person or is it a feeling? Then when y'all did y'all start going through the interaction, right? Y'all start going through the courtship phase and stuff, right? Do you choose to go through that? Or is it your feelings overall making the overall decision making to doing that? I guarantee that uh each and every last one of y'all are choosing to do that. Now, once again, are there feelings involved in it? Absolutely it is. But feelings is not the overall decision-making of the choice. It is you making a sound, logical decision. That is a choice. That is a clear textbook definition of a choice. It's you making a logical and reasonable decision on a situation. The situation I'm talking about is dealing with in a situation of love. So you're choosing that. You're choosing to love that person. You're choosing to allow that person into your your space. You're choosing to do to do certain things to um indicate that you have feelings for that person. To indicate that you love and appreciate that person. You're choosing to do that. It don't have nothing to do with, you know, solely just your feelings. Because also like I stated earlier about your children, the same thing could be true. Where it be moments where you don't feel like loving that person. And the reason why you don't feel like loving that person is because it's a normal human response. Because we're not going to deal with feelings and emotions. Feelings and emotions is always going to change. It's never constant. It's either going to be hot one moment, cold the next moment. It's going to change just like how the wind blows it'd be windy one moment then it'd be calm and still the next moment that's how feelings are but it's part of the human emotions and it's part of the human uh, um, part of the human experience but overall overall feelings do not dictate or determine the overall premises of love 
Love has been and will always be based on a choice that you choose. That's why it's so easy for um, a person to say that they love a person right. Then um, next thing, you know, as people say, it's easy for a person to fall out of love. Because at the end of the day, it's based on a choice. You choose that. So, y'all let me know what y'all think, think about this, because uh, like I say, uh, overall, a choice um, is the overall decision-making of love. So, y'all let me know what y'all think.